<laughs> I've tried to verbalize this or put words to it, but it doesn't always come, come out right. Um, over the last two, three, four weeks, it, it was really the covenant that was on my mind. And uh, while <coughs> learning from Rabbi Katz's uh, material on his website, I learned a, um, a principle of Torah, <coughs> this is also Ger Code, I think, is the, from the mouth of God we heard two. Ever heard that? Never heard that. It's a, I feel, I mean, it's a, we'll, we'll, we'll oscillate back and forth. Mm-hmm. It's a, a Gemara, a Talmudic passage in Makos, on the tractates. Rashi explains what it is. And it says that on Sinai, Mepi HaGevorah, it's called in Hebrew, from the mouth of, why is God called the Gevorah, the mighty one, right, the might of the world. You know, God has weird names sometimes, like the place. God is called the place. God is called the, the might. And the name, again, names of God are not necessarily halo with a harp stuff. It's sometimes very practical. Uh, yud hey vav hey, I was, I will be, I am, right? So... Why do we say from the mouth of God is what God is? The God of Sinai is called the mouth of God. The mouth of the might. God is so mighty that from God who is one, we heard two. For everything that God says, we hear two. Right? We know that in divine language, it's, it's, it's that. Right now, if you listen to my voice, you can hear other, other things coming out. Other levels. If I'm a prophet, I'm even better at it, right? You can you can you can you can catch yourself speaking double language prophecies, right? You know, like the uh, I forget offhand which one examples we say, but um, you know these little words like it and and the, right? Um, it, it never wants to stay on the table, does it? It never wants to stay on the table. So let's say he and I had a previous example where. Uh, the frog who's always jumping on the table doesn't want to stay on the table. Subconsciously, I'm feeding that conversation through. It never wants to stay on the table. And he'd say, they, they never usually do. Right? Frogs don't stay on the table. Whatever. Yeah. There's always a double, double talk going on. Mm. I, mean, I remember being in a restaurant and uh, there's a baseball game and I first started getting the mazel when I, was, when I was younger. And me and Sam, the guy working, he was like, we were looking at the game and he was like, oh, sitting back. He doesn't get it, does he? He never gets it. <laughs> he's not too good this one is he usually they're not as this whole conversation you could feel it was like we were talking about the restaurant workers you know and it's just a perfect digital map so that's and everything in the world has this in the mouth of God I heard too obviously the more holy you are or the message is or prophetic you are for Moses you, you can hear levels and levels it's called Navon hearing the matter in the matter 